Hello everybody, my name is Nightmare, welcome back to Night in the Woods. In the last part we had a little talk with Germ, went around town a bit. Now we're gonna go talk to Greg. Go to band practice, do our next song. Hey Greg. What's up dude? Uh, uh, long night, weird night. What's up? I'll tell you a band practice. Cool. What you up to? Uh, we heading out to band practice? Yeah, let's do this. Hey, Germ. Back to watch this fiasco again, huh? I already talked to you. Yep. You're like our only fan, Germ. I'm just here to be entertained. I'm a gentleman on leisure. Nice. Ready to play? Yeah! Go convince Greg. He's all slow today. Can do. Hey, Angus. Hey, hey, May. What's up? Nothing. Having a very boring week. Jeez, I'm envious. Yeah. Hey, dude! You okay? You look tired. Ugh, I was up all night. They were, like, fixing the roof door, and it was super loud. Roof door? Yeah, the door at the top of the stairs that goes out onto the roof. Now I can, like, I don't know, run from that door down into the lobby, up to the roof, and pee off the side of the building? Yeah, maybe not. But, like, what's to stop random people from doing that, too? Dude, it'll be fine. Sorry, I'm just tired. Fair. Ready to go? Yeah, let's do this! Let's watch this train wreck. Well, May, that was, uh, pretty bad is what it was. I literally don't know this song. Phew. So fast. Just pushed a button. Hmm. I'm so tired. I just strained my vocal cords yelling. Awesome! I'm gonna sound so husky. And anyway, I don't know if they're dreams or not. And this guy, who I think was a ghost, kidnapped some kid and also, I think, was in my head after while I was sleeping. A anyway, yeah, I think I need to do something because this is scary. Well, that's not what I expected to hear tonight. Uh, are you okay, dude? Uh, yeah. I'm not, like, losing it or something. Uh, probably wasn't a ghost. Y yeah, probably not. Definitely. Ah. Uh, okay, fine. I'll go figure it out myself. Uh, dude, don't be like that. You got us. Ah, uh, dudes. Okay, fine. So we need to see may maybe if there's like some ghosty stuff happening around here. Like, from a source we can trust. Such as... Does the newspaper have, like, a ghost section? What? Why is that a dumb question? You know, we could go check the library. For books about it? No, they have, like, the local paper on file. Go back a century. There's some kind of secret history of kidnapper ghosts. We'll find it there. Oh, wow. I didn't know they had that. I thought it was just, like, a broken-down old bunch of books. When's the last time you were at the library? We actually have one of the nicer ones around. Oh. How? 
rich dude who paid for it way back when. Yeah, they set up a foundation and... Hmm? N never mind. Let's go. Can we regroup after? Uh, sure. Okay, we'll be back. Woohoo! Ghosties! That's the spirit! Ha, uh, ghost puns. Look! Jobs! Weird, like. When this was painted, it was like, Hey, look out the window. We're all working. Things are great. Now it's like one of those, you know, one of the graffiti murals after someone gets sh shot or hit by a car. This mural is really affecting you. I forget that we live in separate realities. Mine's clearly better. Yeah. I guess I'm the leader of this pack. Hey. Closing in two hours. Uh, okay, cool. Any idea where the uh, microfish is? Microfish. Microfish. Third floor. Okay, thanks. Up, up, up. Slow night? Yep. Spooky here all along? I'd be spooked. Eh. Larry's wandering around here somewhere. So the elevator drops you off on the second floor. And I don't know if there's anything on the second floor, so we're gonna check it out. So yeah, there was nothing on the second floor. <laughs> oh wow, it's dusty up here. It's old up here. Sure is. Maybe your ghost is up here? Yep, ghost. Or something. Whatever he was. He walked through a chain link fence. Or flew over it. Or something. While carrying something. Alright, well that's even more impressive. So we're gonna find this guy. Because he took someone. Uh -huh. And he's like somehow contacted or connected to this thing I've been going through. And that's not good. It all sounded a lot more badass in my head. It's okay. It was fine. Alright, there she is. Cool. So, I have no idea how to use it. Really? I can't know how to do everything! I'm sorry, but what expertise have you brought to this thus far? This whole thing was my idea. No, your idea was ghost hunting. My idea was to at least do a tiny bit of research on it. If he thinks it's so stupid, why are you here? Because you're my friend. Man, you're just so rude. Aww. Yeah. Aw, we friends be a twist. Here, let me get this set up. We'll be here all night if your dumbass is in charge. That's not very nice, B. Alright, so what are we looking for? I want to steer! No. Move! I'm steering! Ow. Jeez, May. I'm sorry. Okay, 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 okay. How, how do we do this? Step one, look at the screen. Step two, move around and look at stuff. Step three, find ghost. Sure. We got three leads. You're a regular detective. May Borowski, a detective of ghosts. All right, all right, let's go. So we got some leads. 
Can I borrow your car this week? Do you even have a license? I mean, no, regardless, but do you? Nope. No license, no credit cards, don't believe in money. You just believe in other people's cars and money. I didn't choose to be born into this society. Uh, okay, well, I have, yeah, I have, you know, a job. So I can't drive you to all of these spots. I can maybe do the graveyard. I needed to go there anyway. Cool. I'll see if Greg w wants to do the other two. You know, like, and I probably don't have to say this, but just because something happened in the past doesn't mean it's going to happen again. Hey, nerd. Ever hear that history repeats? It does. It does the same thing over and over again. So we've just been in a loop since we were living in caves? Yeah, that's science. Oh my freaking god. <laughs> hey, cool. <clears throat> uh, what's this? Is that Miss Queensley? I added an S. Oh wow, I haven't seen her since graduation. She was always kind of, like, badass. School district did not fund that art program at all. She made it work. She was like some sort of art teacher survivalist. Wow, I never even realized. I think they pay her in bits of string and empty soda cans. <clears throat> Thank you all for coming to the second meeting of the Possum Springs Poetry Society. Do you want to stick around for this? Yeah, because Selmers is here. Tonight, we have new poems from myself, and Fisherman Jones, and Selma and Forrester. I will start us off with one of my own. They don't actually pay her in string, right? Yes, May. They literally pay her in string. I was just joking. Right. Ahem. Letter to my worst student. To my worst student, the subject of my stories. I tell friends back home, when they ask about life out here in the sticks, it is you. I worry. At the end of my life, you will be the only one I can remember. Why did you key my car? I know it was you, Brian. Thanks, everyone. Poor Mrs. Queenly. I can't read that name, apparently. At least she's blowing off some steam. Next up, uh, Fisherman Jones. Fisherman Jones has a uh, poem for us. Uh, two, two poems. Uh, they're very uh, short, though. Two poems. Take it away. Uh, hi, hi, folks. Uh, thanks. Th this is called uh, uh, Tuttle Eels. Tuttle Eels. Tuttle Eels. I don't know how it feels. To be in darkness all the time, born in muck and raised in slime. But neither do you know the paths I've trudged. So hard it is your place to judge. <laughs> okay, uh, that's one poem. The next one is shorter. This is called uh, t Tunnel Frogs. Tunnel Frog swims in the dark. Must think it would be a lark. To be a fisherman like me. But what do you know, amphibie? Mm, that's it. Oh, that is great. Thank you, Fisherman Jones. He definitely talks to the actual fish. Almost definitely. And finally, a poem by Selma Ann Forrester. Yeah, Selmers! Thanks, May. You know her? Dude, she's like your neighbor. Oh. She writes those really funny, dorky short poems. Porums? 
I'm up for something short and funny. This is called There's No Reception in Possum Springs. Ha ha ha. She's not wrong. <clears throat> no reception here. I wave my black phone. In the air, like a flare, like a prayer, but no reception. I read on the internet, baby-faced boy, billionaire. Phone app sold, made more money in one day than my family in over a hundred generations. More than my whole world has ever world where house buying jobs became rent paying jobs became living without family jobs boy billionaires money is access access to politicians waiting for us to die Le yeah lead in our water alcohol and painkillers replace my job with an app replace my dreams of a house in a yard with a couch in a basement the future is yours, force 24-7 entrepreneurs. I just want a paycheck and my own life. I'm on the couch in the basement. They're in the house in the yard. Some night I will catch a bus out to the west coast and burn their Silicon City to the ground. Holy crap. Wow. Damn. Uh, she rhymed entrepreneur. I don't even know what that word means. Thanks, everybody. <laughs> Is she always like this? No. Wow. Huh. Uh, th thank you, everyone. See you in two weeks. Hey, Selmers. What? I liked your weird poem. Thanks. I wrote it myself. Wait. Was the assumption that she didn't write it herself? Nice work, Selmers! I don't like that nickname. What are you two? Sorry. It's cool. Can we go now? She doesn't like Selmers? Oh, that stinks. Okay. Thanks for coming. Uh, we live here? Right. So... Found out anything about your ghost? Yeah. Oh, I like that head nod animation. That's clever. Tell him, B. <laughs> there were some newspaper clippings that talked about a ghost. <laughs> Not just any ghost. Little Joe. Uh, I don't really remember Little Joe. He's a ghost miner. He died in mysterious circumstances. Wow. I know, right? Mys mysterious. I thought you were, like, afraid of this ghost. Like, filled with, like, dread and crap. I'm terrified! Uh, okay. So, it mentioned three different places we can all check out. Uh, I have work and stuff. Yeah, G Greg and I also have work. You guys skip out on work all the time. Maybe we can, like, split this up. Share custody of you and your ghost. What place were you thinking about? Uh, the graveyard. I call that one. It's close and not illegal. Is there an illegal one? Hmm. Sure is. The Historical Society. You know, you don't have to, like, break in. People are there, like, get paid to show you it. Anyway, I'm in for the Historical Society. Awesome. So what did I get stuck with? Possum Jump. Oh, I, I, I know Possum Jump. We used to go there in Scouts. Perfect. Uh, okay, so I like need to actually get home and do work. This is gonna be awesome. And I'm also scared to death. Thought, if I die, someone should write a poem about it. Hey, no. Go into the living room. There you go. Hey, erg. Yeah, seems like that's going around. 
The erg. Yeppers. So, uh, you and Mom had a bit of a fight yesterday, huh? Yeah. I thought you two were getting along. We are. Just a bump. You two. Always two alike. I guess. I got your chill and... Yeah, I got your chill and her smart assness. I just hate to see you two out on the outs again. It'll be fine. We're cool. So, we're having money problems? What? No, no. We're fine. Dad. May, it's fine. It's okay. I'm 20. I can handle it. Nothing to handle. Okay. Computer, don't fall asleep. Don't do that. Might just head up to bed tonight. Sounds good, kid. Been a long couple of days. Oh boy. Hey, May. Let me know when you want to go to the park. I looked up a map and uh, it's a pretty straight shot up to ju possum jump. Okay, great. We never really get a chance to hang out. It'll be fun, I think. Alright, I'm going to sleep. Night, sir. Tips hat. Yo! I looked up the historical society on the internet! It's like really old, but then they did big renovations. Oh, really? I mean, listen, I'm not saying there's a ghost, but old stuff that just got torn up seems like go central. How so? You're a ghost hanging out in an old house, and then someone puts a pool where you died or something? Haunted pools would actually be scary. I'm spooked. I'm going to bed. <sighs> hey, uh, let me know when you want to go hit the cemetery. Should be around most nights this week. I don't know. Thanks, B. Don't thank me too hard. I'm going, yeah, I'm going there anyway. It's like right down the road. You're running, yeah, you're ruining this. Oh, in that case. You are so incredibly welcome, and also, you better not forget this big favor. That's more like it. I'm falling asleep. Had fun tonight. Sorry if I was grouchy. It's just... It's fine. Wait, did you actually fall asleep? LOL. Hi. Bedtime? Yes. Well, thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, leave a like to let me know. And if not, that's alright. I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye!